Hi guys, XS Soccer 35 here, back again with a new video, and today is episode one of Inside RuneScape. And, and in this series, this is a series I've done in the past on, like I, I said in a video before, like about five years ago. On, well, <coughs> mainly a uh, there's a only type of videos that was on this channel. And is that my voice? It was. Yes. Music like Drop and Play, Spider Disturb, which got me a copyright strike. And whatnot. So. Okay. Inside RuneScape is a news series for RuneScape, but. This rebrand of the series is going to cover other video game news as well. Getting started, let's get the RuneScape news out of the way. Okay, um, for the updates in December, <coughs> come into RuneScape. Link will be in the description for all these things I've been confirmed. So, this is behind the scenes. For December 2016 of RuneScape. First off is uh, Lusque's Endgame. The final quest in the four quest series <coughs> of uh, Lusque's Lisk Endgame concludes this month. I'm gonna, not going to read it all because that inside RuneScape ain't going to be those type of long videos anyway. And the second update is the Christmas update. If you don't know about RuneScape, every holiday, well, Easter, uh, Halloween, and Christmas, they do holiday events which last two weeks. But this year they're redoing what they did last year, when the event lasted the whole month. And each week, when was updated, they un they unlocked a new area, a new area of the Christmas update. <coughs> I don't think the rewards have been announced yet. Uh, okay, now the rooms case up. Uh, oh yeah. Plus they're having like what they. Started up last year, uh, six straight weeks of uh, weekend events called uh, the Winter Weekends. It kick started this past weekend, the third. Well, it started the second because of Friday. And what? And it ends the second week, uh, the second week, I believe, in uh, January. Hmm. Cause it goes all this month into like the second week in of January. So now that's out of the way. Let's get to the video game news. Okay, um, in case you wasn't aware, this past weekend in uh, Anaheim, California, there was this little convention. At, it's on its well, this was its third year. Started two, three years ago. <coughs> Back on, on the 20th anniversary of PlayStation, the PlayStation Experience Convention, or PSX, what they prefer it to as. Uh, if you don't know what it is, it's an event for uh, PlayStation fans and video game fans come all together, and it's nothing but PlayStation there. Along with it, new games were announced. A lot, well, a lot of sequels of new games were, and updates on games and whatnot. Okay, Crash Bandicoot Remastered. This was confirmed back in E3 of this year, but this one reveals the title of the remasters and the gameplay, which is something we didn't get back at E3. The remaster is going to be called Crash in period Sane Trilogy. And it's 
coming out next year on the PS4. You can pre-order it now on the PS Store for $39.99. I tried looking for a demo to do a sort of a let's play to sh for you guys, but yeah. Will I be pre-ordering this game they want? Oh. Yeah. Fuck yes, I will. And ignore this. <laughs> <clears throat> hey, on to the next game announced. Knack 2, the sequel to the 2013, yeah, 2013 uh, launch title uh, for the PS4. Knack. It's being, Knack 2 is being released. I don't think no release date was confirmed yet. Next one, um... Gravity Rush 2, I think got his release date revealed. I'm not entirely sure. And frick, scratch the Gravity Rush one. Um, the lot, the big event, which was the reveal at the end of the show, of the show, which kicked off PSX, was The Last of Us 2 being officially announced. Yeah, that's right. Except they ain't call, straight up called The Last of Us 2. It's called The Last of Us Part 2. And not much is known about it because it's still really early in development. And cause pro my guess will probably release in either 2018, 2019. The latest, the earliest, but highly unlikely. Later next year, around this time, 2017, December 2017, but I don't see that happening. Oh, and also, they're remastering old games. Uh, one that was on the PS1, it well, it started out on the PS1. I think the sequel to it uh, <coughs> was on the PS2. And it's being remastered. They're remastering Papa the Rappa in full 1080p from the ground up by, and with native 4K support for, of course, the PlayStation 4 Pro. And I'm not really much of a Papa the Rapper fan, but I d do know it has a really strong following and people's been warning like a sequel and whatnot to that. Who knows, they may make a sequel, if this does well. Another game they're remastering with 4K support, and there's also another one. This one's Loco Moco, and then I think, oh, Patapong? I'll link the description, link in the description. Uh, oh, and the Uncharted 4 DLC, single player DLC, was announced, and well, it's sort of a standalone title slash not. It's called Uncharted The Lost Legacy. And you play as Nadine, who meets up with Chloe. So I understand this. I have yet to play Uncharted 4, okay? So, yeah, I have played Uncharted 1, 2, 3 on PS3, but that's it. Uh, will I get the Uncharted collection for PS4? I don't know. And uh, with that being said, this is the end of Inside RuneScape Episode 1. Yeah, these will more than likely be a monthly series, so... Yeah. And with that being said, remember to comment, like, subscribe if you're new... And favorite video if you want to. And this has been XS Doctor Thirty Five signing.